Hey, I'm KIC and I screwed up, but I was feeling lazy about it, so I figured, eh, let's just see how this goes. Shutter door, go ahead and open. Let's see what sort of madness I'm getting myself into. You don't know what I screwed up, well, you can, you can make your guesses, make your assumptions. I'll tell you, it has to do with not bringing the correct equipment. Namely, I forgot all my healing stuff. Or at least a lot of it. Wow, and there goes 100 health. Just like that. That really didn't take long. It's all right, I brought the correct gun. So, I mean, we've got that going on for us at the very least. It's a little dark in here. It's a little better. Thank you. Much appreciate that. Looks like we got a nice little console and all sorts of stuff going on in here. What do we have? A laser rifle? No kidding. Medical device blocks. That's exciting. Xeno steel blocks. Oh. This block slash device is alien. By placing it, you will not be able to spawn your structure in a survival game. That sounds like something I should take. Just to be on the safe side. Antibionics, sure. More shotgun upgrade kits because you know what? You just can't get enough of them. There's a lever right here. Let's pull it. The data has been erased from the log files, but the remaining traces indicate there is a backup saved in the hidden mainframe building itself. Go to the uplink control, then find the lever to start the log downloads. Where is the uplink control? I, I see my floaty ship. Uplink control, where are you? Xenu mainframe, damaged main tower, alien watchtower. I suspect I need to go drive around now. That's exciting. Um, really? You're telling me I cannot damage that? No kidding. Mr. Rocket Launcher, or Mrs. Oh, crap. I even forgot the rockets. Never mind. Ah, oh, that's, that's a bummer. Can I... Here, can I... Uh, that gun. Can I at least, like... No, can I... Can I do that? No. Really? I can see the core right there. And you're telling me I cannot damage it with anything. That's... That's not okay in my book. Well, apparently I gotta go drive around, so I'll, I'll meet you back at the ship. I will make it my goal to return to this building and tear it asunder at some indeterminate point in the future. Let's go ahead and use the medic station that I placed very subtly right here on the ship. And let's go drive around a bit, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I, I should turn this into a montage, because everyone loves a montage. Or something like that. Here, we'll, we'll drive for a minute. And if I don't find anything quickly, then... Yeah, I'm going to montage it. And honestly, I probably should go back to base anyway, because... I forgot so many critical things, so why don't we just assume that's what I'm going to do, and if I don't, well, you'll find out in just a second anyway, now won't you? Aha! I've been backtracking through this stupid place, and, um... Hmm. Apparently, I missed this earlier. I don't remember missing it, but it appears I did. Huh! <gasps> there it is! Okay, now where are you? I've already been in here. This activated something, but what did it do? Press F to teleport to mainframe at Xenu mainframe. Awesome. Perfect. Yeah, I was, I was uh, just going back through this whole map looking for something and just found that. So let's, well, let's teleport and see what happens. Oh, crap. Yep. I wondered if this might happen. Uh, I thought I remembered that this was a mainframe or something, or maybe I saw it. I don't know. I... Uh, go find the lever to release the data. Be careful where you're shooting. Do not destroy important devices. How are you supposed to know whether something is important if uh, you don't really know what's important? 
That seems like a flaw in the logic, but what what I know, I'm just a dumb Terran. Oh, hi. You didn't do much damage, thankfully. That's good. I should also tell you that I have since... Uh-oh. What do we got here? Another one of those guys. I've actually had time to go back to base and resupply and grab all the things I forgot to grab originally, so... Yeah, I might have done that. Which is probably a good thing. Is that... Is that floor open? I can't even tell. This is bad. It's so dark right now. I'm really tempted to go into night vision. Yikes. Also, yikes. Get around the corner, yikes. Destroy all the things. All right, so far, not too bad. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely taking damage. I'm not trying to say I'm not. I'm just saying, so far, acceptable damage, I, I think. Ooh, I'll take some fuel packs. Definitely. I'm not going to take the, the pistol ammo. You might notice I'm not actually carrying a pistol. It's because I left it in the storage of the not a mini bike. Despite my repeated desires to call it as such. Let's reload and then we'll get this next guy. Just out of curiosity, do you guys light up in any way? Not really. I was just curious if, you know, get a little thermal or something going on. I don't know. Maybe it's some crazy awesome... Ooh, steel plates. I'll take those, uh, sort of night vision. I mean, it is the future, after all. You never know what is possible in the future. Oh, man, I have a feeling. Hi. Totally missed that, I think because the other one was right on top of it. That this is going to be another massive building to basically go wander through. And if I knew where I were going, that would probably help, I guess. I don't know, but I don't, so never mind that. Cannot use you? That's a shame. I am all about healing myself for free if I can. I mean, and at this point, it's not like it's easy to leave and go back and resupply. I've got to teleport out of here and wander back through a base and all that jazz, so we got to make this count. Holy crap. That's the second time that's happened now. You guys are dying, so to speak, like right on top of stuff. That's super inconvenient. I wish that one would actually heal me. That would be much better. Okay, I'm going to say we're good in here. Oh, man. Do I go outside or do I go inside? I guess either way is going to be bad. Because you got bots and stuff patrolling everywhere. Can I get a can I get eyes on you? Where'd you go, buddy? Where'd you go? There you are. Perfect. Okay. Let's do this. I'm gonna try and go super slowly here. So that I can do stuff like that. Kind of backing myself around a little bit. Nudging down. I'm looking for spawning pads like that one. Okay, anything else? Again, I'm just, I'm trying to take my time here. Never been, never been high. You need to stop what you're doing. That means there's going to be a spawning pad over there, if I'm not mistaken. There could be, eh, you might have just been wandering around. I guess that's a fair possibility too. Hi. Dang it. Is that a spawning pad? It sure looks like it. Gonna shoot it all gangsta style and sideways. Cargo box, electronics, and nanotubes. Sure. Jetpack boost. Don't I have a ton of those? I mean, maybe I'll take one just for laughs, but I don't know. 
I'm going to go ahead and hit you. Sure. Nanotubes and optical fibers. I'm probably going to dump this stuff if I find anything at all interesting comparatively. But I'll take fuel packs and projectile rounds. Projectile rifle rounds all day long. Lots of cargo boxes and that sort of stuff in here. So guessing this is not the data warehouse that I'm looking for. I don't know, maybe I should be taking all these boosts, but I kind of feel like meh about them. Meh. It's a technical term. Meh. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and take this moment to do this, and we'll do one more V8. There you go. This episode is not sponsored by V8. I don't even like that stuff. Okay, looking good. Looking good-ish. How about that? We're looking good-ish. Ish. Not good, just good-ish. But man, the funny thing about all this is... Hi. I'm actually finding it somewhat difficult to uh, enjoy the area because I'm so busy trying not to die. I'll leave stone dust. That is really not what I came here for. Okay, so this level looks like... Wait a minute. What happened? I just took two damage. There you are. Where did you come from? That means I missed a spawner somewhere. Where's your spawner? Oh, crap. Oh, no. You're not the spawner. Never mind. I thought that was... Or, uh, I thought that was a, not a spawner. I thought that was another, another defense bot. Well, crud, where did that guy come from? Did I just miss it earlier? Robot! Where were you hiding? Assuming that's what you were doing. Silicon? No. We'll iron? Uh, we'll take multi-charge, though. Plastic raw, we can get all that stuff. Iron and silicon, no worries. Don't need. Mobility boost. Ahax plants. Um, okay. Ooh, armor boost. That does sound exciting. I will take that. I paid zero attention to what else it needs. Okay. I feel like I didn't miss anything in here, and yet I probably did. That's okay. Hit that cargo box. I think we've hit these other ones. The only question I think I have at this point in terms of where we can go in here is just to check right over this way. This There's this one spot that looks a little funky to me, and... You don't open. There is a switch right there. You actually found the missing data from the Titan! Well, crap. I, I think I actually was where I was supposed to be. Go figure! The logs reveal that the enemy the UCH fleet was facing is the so-called Zyrax Empire! They seem to have waited at the exit point of the fleet and directly attacked the vessels without warning. The Titan and other ships were lost in that battle. Those that did not crash on the planet due to the gravity might still be in orbit. You really need to find them anytime soon, as you found out something even more disturbing. Recalculating the timestamps of the log entries, there is a strange discrepancy to your suit's internal systems. While you started on your journey in 2473, this is not 2473, but if the calculations are correct, 2483. Ten years after the fleet dispatched for Andromeda, the turbulences when... <sighs> Elyon, give me like 12 minutes and I will polish this crap up for you. And all I ask is that you, uh, I don't know, just say thanks or something. This is horrible. You, you, need, you need a native English speaker who also knows grammar rules and all that stuff to actually polish this up. I digress. The turbulences when leaving Apollon Station, the failed experiment, the alien troops infesting the space station, the fighting you faced until you managed to escape to hyperspace, the fleet ambushed and its survival at least questionable, as well as the time that has passed, all these events seem to be interrelated. That is the worst sentence I've read today. What has gone wrong? Did the sample from the station's engine room cause all this? Maybe the experiments that were going on in the station? Cake-eating scientists accidentally screwed up the whole mission? Haha. -ha. Maybe all this happened on purpose? One riddle solved, a new one gotten. Okay. 
Well, I think that does it for the main mission. Cool. That actually makes me wonder if there's still more to do here because I remember seeing another elevator. Let's go check that out. Just to be clear, that does it for, um, well, what was it? The Robinson Protocol? So I guess we're done with that, which is cool. And then there are all these other solo things that we can do. Delicious green eating, dinner for two, clans of aqua, etc., etc. I'm probably not going to concern myself with those. And rather, what I'm going to do is go, oh, crap, I need to drop down because I just realized I went higher. And I wasn't paying attention to where that turret was. Where are you, turret? There you are. Right there, I think? Yeah. You cannot damage this target with this weapon, so says the exploding turret. I would like to continue. Hey! Knock that stuff off. I think you're a little too far away for me. Oh, crap. That's the problem. There's something in the way that I can't damage. Well, that's problematic. My goodness, that was annoying. I'd like to keep playing until I can... Hello! Hello! Get off the planet. And then kind of from there, we can figure out uh, how far do we go with this thing. Now, what I would also really like to do is... I'd like to take out the core and insert my own core. Oh, <gasps> Sathium ingots. Take them, take them, take them. Take them, take them, take them. And a railgun. That's exciting. I like railguns a lot. Railguns are my favorite. Fuel tanks. I cannot access you guys because reasons. Because you're, you know, a different thing and all that. Ooh, ammo box. We'll take that. I'm just going to basically gank everything I can here. I'm just going to take whatever I can, because it's mine now. Computers, glass plates. We're going to leave those guys. We don't need them. What else do we have going on in here, huh? I'm so curious. I know we've got two, two very rare, or maybe just rare. I'm not sure what whichever boxes over here. Do we have any more any more things that need to be shot at? You. Hi, you need to be shot at. Great. Glad we were able to take care of that. Hello! Hello! Is there anybody here? Hello! Nope, I don't think so. Good, let's check out whether... Um, don't get stuck. Rare or very rare. I think they're just... Well, it doesn't say rare, but I think this qualifies as rare. Solar panel blocks, cobalt. We'll take the cobalt, because we cannot get that on this planet right now. Stunning fuel... Uh, steel blocks, we'll take those. I should probably be taking these... Iron ingots just because there are a lot of them and we can stack those guys up nicely. And I don't remember if there were iron ingots over here. I guess I should probably be a good scavenger and check. Let's see, you were a mobility boost. And let's see, you. Let's see, what, what, wasn't there a storage container over here too? Did I, did I make that up? I'm pretty sure there was one. I guess it's just you. All right, well, cool. I think there still might be one more area to check out over here, so let's go ahead and go down to the next level. I think that's where we came in. Hello, everyone. You're all dead. You're welcome. I just wanted to check. Uh, I guess I could sleep till morning. That's awkward. Ooh, laser pistol. Oh, laser pistol. Oh, my. What do I drop to take a laser pistol? That's a good little chunk of pentaxid there, by the way. That's pretty exciting. I guess I could drop an anti-rad pill. I think we have some of those at home anyway. The thing I wanted to check, and I guess there's no need to check it, is right there. That goes down to uh, nothing, as far as I can tell. I didn't notice the core while I was in there. I would imagine I just missed it. Unless it's like... Oh, wow. Um... Right up there, maybe? There's a generator or something. Or at least some sort of decorative block. I'm not really sure which it is. Whatever. Either way. I guess we can go back. Well, there we are. We are all done with this. I have one last thing I would like to find out. 
So if you give me just a second, we'll uh, find that one out together. I'm going to go reheal, which means I got to go this way. My bad. I don't think I realized it when the mission finished, but I think the game populated a bunch of stuff into my inventory, like extra heavy ar or medium armor that Pentaxid. Probably some other stuff, too. I, I don't even know. Whatever. I came back to find out the answer to one simple question. Wow. Apparently, the answer to my question is... I don't know what the answer to my question is. I don't know how to interpret that. What did happen right there? I, I don't even know. I blew up some stuff, apparently. No? Okay. Well, that got rid of the, st the, the stairs, but it appears the core is still undamaged and my rockets did nothing. So I'm going to call that good. I'm going to call that done. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to meet you back probably at the base and we are going to start work on collecting the necessary resources, materials, etc. required to get the crap off this planet. So I'll catch you in that one until then. Thanks for watching. See you later.